Welcome everyone to Virtual Reality. This video is introduced by Truckfam, Val Bubi, Jesslyn Pamela, Candida Pinto. Virtual reality is an artificial environment that is created with software and presented to the user in such a way that the user suspends belief and accepts it as a real environment. On a computer, virtual reality is primarily experienced through two of the five senses, sight and sound. Healthcare is one of the biggest adopters of virtual reality which encompasses surgery simulation, phobia treatment, robotic surgery and skills training. Virtual reality is described as an advanced form of human-computer interface that allows the user to interact with and become immersed in a computer-generated environment in a naturalistic fashion. Virtual reality immersion is basically a unique experience that is connected with the world of virtual reality. Over here the user, while exploring the three-dimensional world of virtual reality will simply immerse into this make-believe world as the real world. Virtual reality systems can be classified into three categories. Immersive systems are properly the most widely known virtual reality systems where the users either wears a head-mounted display. In non-immersive virtual reality, the user placed in a 3D environment that can be directly manipulated with a conventional graphics workstation using a monitor, a keyboard and a mouse. A semi-immersive virtual reality system comprises of a relatively high-performance graphics computing system coupled with either a large screen monitor, or a large screen projector, or multiple television projection systems. Using a wide field of view, semi-immersive virtual reality system provides a better feeling of immersion or presence than the non-immersive system. Virtual reality hardware includes some image generator, manipulation and control device, stereo vision, and head-mounted display. The image generator is one of the most consuming tasks in virtual reality. One key element for interaction to the virtual world that is tracking the position of real-world objects such as head or hand. The use of glove is to manipulate objects in the computer by using and build sensors which fit it on fingers for tracking. This is accomplished by creating two different images of the world one for each eye. The images can project it through differently polarized filters or placed in front of our eyes. When these images are shown on this vision in rapid speed, then the brain fuses these two images in a single image and can get 3D experience. This head-mounted display is a helmet or face mask that holds the visual and auditory. Some of the advantages of include safety and easy to handle. Virtual reality environment do not require interaction with the original or actual environment which is more safe and easy to handle. Virtual reality helps those that cannot get out of the house experience a much fuller life. These patients can explore the world through virtual environments like a virtual reality community on the Internet. Virtual reality can also be used for safe medical training. Virtual reality is used to educate patients like stopping smoking and moderate alcohol intake. Educating people how to make positive change for their health and reduce the risk of illnesses. Doctors are using virtual reality to reteach muscle movements such as walking and grabbing. Using the malleable computerized environments to increase or decrease the motion needed to grab or move an object. This helps to record exactly how quickly a patient is learning and recovering. For the disadvantages, the hardware needed to create a fully immersed virtual reality experience is cost prohibitive because it is still new and experimental. The total cost of the machinery to create a virtual reality system is too high. Also some side effects of exposure to virtual reality environments that could lead to problems including symptoms of motion sickness and strain on the ocular system issue is lack of standardization of devices and software. This situation forces the researchers to spend much time and money in designing and developing both the virtual reality system and the related protocol. The idea of escapism among those that use the virtual reality environment and people often live in the virtual world instead of dealing with the real one. 
training with a virtual reality does not have the same consequences as in the real world. Because even if someone does well with simulated tasks in a virtual reality environment, that person might not do well in the real world. For the case study, as the technology becomes more population, the use of virtual reality in the U.S. healthcare industry has expanded due to extensive product development and the growing implementation of health information technology. They are associated with many leading areas of medical technology innovation. The virtual reality has been introduced to healthcare such as surgery circumstance including surgical navigation, image-guided surgery, computer-assisted surgery, augmented reality, robot-assisted surgery. Also for the medical data visualization which is multi-modality image fusion, advanced 2D-3D-4D image reconstruction, and pre-operative planning, as well as the education and rehabilitation. This picture is showing how telepresence surgery performed, which permits the surgeon to operate on a patient across distances. This is achieved through real-time 3D video vision, stereo audio and remote instrument control with haptic feedback. As training, mobile virtual reality devices are changing the ways hospitals and healthcare providers are training doctors, nurses, and medical personnel. This device will allow doctors and medical professionals to practice procedures that they do not regularly have access to in the office. Recently, Nicholas Children's Hospital has partnered with Next Galaxy Corporation to create software designed for some procedures in hospital. Examples, cardiopulmonary resuscitation, nasogastric tube insertion, Foley catheter insertion, intubation, wound care. For the clinical healthcare setting, virtual reality offers doctors and medical professionals to simulate surgery and other intensive procedures. Physicians receive both physical and visual feedback when going through the motions of a procedure right are a more realistic and memorable experience for staff members. Helping hospitals and medical facilities reduce cost of training. Here are some reference that we used for this video. References Sensen, Alex. Virtual Reality in Healthcare, Where's the Innovation? TechCrunch. NP, the 16th of September 2015. Web. The 12th of April 2016. Virtual Reality Gear, Virtual Reality. Virtual Reality Society. NP, the 25th of December 2015. Web. The 18th of April 2016. Virtual Rehabilitation. Virtual Rehabilitation. NP, ND Web. The 18th of April 2016. Virtual Reality, Pros and Cons. Virtual Reality 007. NP, the 18th of March 2012. Web. The 18th of April 2016. Thank you for watching our video.